Bill Condon, director de la cinta La Bella y la Bestia, próxima a estrenarse mundialmente. Visitó tierras mexicanas para promocionar el filme junto con el actor inglés Dan Stevens. What I was interested in is that in the very original story, which got popularized about 20 years later by a different author, there had been much more about how the beast, the prince, became cursed, you know. I think with the prince and, and, and with our beast, we were looking at, you know, some of the qualities that led him to be cursed in the first place. And I think, you know, the idea that this spoilt little prince who, you know, the little boy, you know, behaves terribly and throws tantrums and Stevens, quien también fue parte de la galardonada serie Downtown Abbey, mencionó que la cinta es más que una lección de humildad. Se trata de expandir la mente y explorar reinos sin límites junto con Bella, que no es una princesa convencional. I mean, she's really Belle is is really not a princess and she's one of the few Disney princesses who who isn't uh, really looking for that uh, that sort of that prince charming. But it's really the books, it's the it's the imagination the desire to explore, to expand her mind and her world and the immediate surroundings, uh, they're just, they're not enough. She knows there's more out there. El director de la cinta afirmó que esta historia de más de 300 años de antigüedad es un testamento de la eterna naturaleza de la belleza interna. La lucha por salir de las construcciones sociales y la reivindicación de la mujer en las historias de amor, donde ella puede rescatarse a sí misma. Mostly it's about the basic message of of taking a closer look at people and, and seeing inside people and not being so distracted by, by whatever the surface is. Con información de Pamela Cruz y Aileen González. Notimex.